back to Hey Kentucky. I'm Mary Jeffrino alongside Perrin Johnson, and we are getting ready for the SEC tournament here in Nashville. Of course, Kentucky doesn't play until Friday afternoon, but we've already seen quite a few UK fans down here. Yeah, it's like they've already come down here, and um, it's really a good time, but I'm, I'm surprised that Big Blue Nation is already here. As soon as we got off the elevator, we saw somebody in the hotel, We're walking down the street, we saw several people, so they're always around just, you know, anywhere you go in this town right now. So, of course, it's, Nashville's a big tourist area anyways. Broadway is always packed. This is drawing a huge crowd or expected to draw a huge crowd as it usually does. But of course, we've been talking a lot about the coronavirus and what that means for travel and what that means for large crowd events like this. But you know what? I think a lot of people are worried about flying on airplanes because when you're on an airplane, the air is recirculated. So I feel like a lot of fans are driving up to be at this event. So I feel I feel as if they have a, they're a little bit safer. The concerns might be in the arena or maybe at the bars and restaurants here because of the close proximity to people. But so far, so good. And it seems like everybody's not worried about it so far a ton. Well, we definitely did check in with some fans and some local businesses to see if they are worried about the coronavirus affecting the crowds. Was there ever any thought about not coming to a place where there was going to be large crowds? Uh, we thought about it a little bit, and then we decided we just can't stay in a dungeon the rest of our lives. So we're just going to take precautions and, you know, watch ourselves, and we'll be fine. So you guys live here, so you didn't have to travel in. Has there been uh, any concern here for, like, the coronavirus with a lot of people coming into town? Well, not really about them coming in, but it's on TV and... Every time you turn on, it's something else. And, you know, a little bit concerned. We're just more careful now. Sort of try to wash hands. I think it's just more important not to give it to people who actually could, like, get sick and die from it, like older people and kids. That's kind of more what I've heard. Um, with me, I'm not really too worried about it because I'm 25. I'm more concerned with, like, hey, I need to wash my hands for other people's safety. The gloves. It's a precaution for... It is. It is. I work with the public. Um, I sit here and um, I'm a door greeter and we get people in and, and to try our world famous Jack's Barbecue. Uh, recently with the coronavirus, yes, I've started wearing gloves as so, a precaution. So that's a, a you decision or is it kind of? Well, it was actually my decision. Of course, my boss is in favor of it. Are you guys doing anything in particular to keep people safe from that or you guys have any concerns about that? I mean, yeah. I mean, we've got lights all wipes, so we've got extra hand sanitizer, stuff like that. But I mean, I think the management here is doing a really good job of trying to make sure that we're up to date on what's going on with it and just taking the every precaution we can. Just wash your hands, don't touch your face. Do you feel like tourism or, or game attendance will be down? I do. I do feel that way. Um, um, I mean, hopefully not for businesses, but I do feel like that we won't have a big turnout like we normally do. Do you worry that people will not be coming down because of it? I don't, I don't think so. I mean, people come to Nashville for this tournament almost every year when it's here. It's a big Kentucky bar. People come down from Kentucky. This place is usually wall to wall packed with people. So I think it's, we may see a little bit of a dip in it, but I don't think it's going to be a huge one. You're more worried about losing than you are about right, the crowd. Right, of course, yeah. <laughs> Hopefully we can stick around at least a couple days. I mean, we got to be Vandy, right? You, you would think. Yeah, so if that happens, you know, I'll just trade my stuff in for some blue and join the crowd. You don't want there to be a, a panic. Right. You want to be cautious, but you kind of can't have that fear either. Go root on the cats. I know. And if Ashton Haggins is good, I think we should all be good, right? Yes. <laughs> so, yeah, taking precautions, which is what Governor Bashir and, uh, you know, everyone up to the president has been asking us to do is wash your hands, uh, make sure that you are um, just getting yourself clean. No, I mean, I've, I've been washing my hands like crazy. I've always been a big key component of washing your hands. But it's, it's funny to see everybody else, like, not even shaking hands no more, giving fist bumps and elbow touches because everybody's concerned to a degree. But they're also trying to live a normal life as well. Yeah. Um, we haven't seen anybody really with masks on or anything like that. So if you are planning on heading down to Nashville, you will probably not be alone. We're going to have much more coverage from Nashville and the SEC tournament coming up on Hey Kentucky tomorrow and Friday 